Cheek to Cheek is a form of dance popularized in the 1930s by Fred Astaire and Ginger Rogers. It takes a lot of good physical coordination and training to perform a cheek to cheek ballroom dance correctly. The partners begin with their hips level, shoulder joint firm, and heads turn slightly to their left. One or both of them may then slide their feet side by side, creating a figure eight pattern. As the music swells, the dancers may slowly turn and spiral their arms in a sinuous motion. They may also alternate between the figures of eight and reverse turns. This playful, intimate dance is often done in a slow rhythm, as the dancers alternate between touching and pulling away from each other. This keeps the dance from becoming too predictable or one-sided. Cheek to cheek tends to be more romantic and graceful than other forms of ballroom dancing. To create the desired effect, both partners must have a good sense of balance. Couples must also be well matched in order for the dance to work best. To make a successful cheek to cheek performance, partners must move in unison. This means they must be in sync with each other. Proper understanding of the music is essential, as the song's tempo and structure determine the dance's style. Each individual must be able to follow the other, and each must be level-headed and experienced. When pulled off correctly, this romantic dance can leave the audience enchanted. Cheek to cheek is a perfect way for couples to truly express their love for one another. It is not a fast-paced dance, but provides an excellent platform for practice, improvement, and enjoyment. Training for this ballroom number usually involves learning the steps, steps combinations, timing, control, and body movement. Each of these components must be finely tuned before a dance can be presented in public. Teaching this playful number usually begins with a few basic steps, such as the box step and the side step. Other important parts of the dance include posture, arm placement, proper lead, and follow techniques, and music interpretation. Once the basics are mastered, couples should practice together in order to gain confidence and rhythm. Cheek to cheek requires a lot of practice and patience, as it does take a while to perfect the moves. Those who find themselves struggling should feel free to get assistance from experienced coaches. The best way to learn is with other couples, as it allows for mutual support and understanding.